Hello 3i. I'm John Dalton, who proposed an atomic theory which became a landmark in the history of chemistry. Let me personally explain what my theory is all about. Here are the principal postulates of my theory. 1. Elements are composed of minute, discrete, and indivisible particles called atoms. 2. Atoms of the same element are identical. Atoms of different elements are different. 3. Compounds are composed of atoms of more than one element. In any compound, the combination of atoms is in fixed ratio of small whole numbers. 4. A chemical reaction involves the separation, combination or rearrangement of atoms. It does not result in the destruction of the atoms nor the creation of other kinds of atom. My theory has been confirmed by further studies and experiments. In its broad outline, the theory is still valid today. However, the limits of my postulates are now recognized. Oh, hey, didn't see that. Take a walk with me. Now, the funny thing about Dalton's atomic theory is everything is made up of atoms. Now look at that jack wagon over there. Now look back at me. He had a blue lightsaber. I have a green lightsaber. My atoms are a blue lightsaber. Now look back at me. I can get away! Ride, horsey! Oh, son of a... Finally the end. Victory is mine. I'm an atom. I cannot be destroyed! No! Neither can I. Touché. Let's say this is a compound. This compound is made up of different kinds of atoms. These atoms cannot be created, destroyed, or converted. So if I destroy it like this... Even though the compounds were destroyed, or the atoms were not, and each atom can be reused and made with a diff different atom to make compounds or elements again, like... multiple proportions. The ratio would turn from 1 to 1 to 2 to 1, yellow to blue. And that is the law. 